Most drivers don't like waiting at traffic lights, but we know we need the traffic lights. And one Denver 7 viewer told our traffic anchor Jason Luber she wanted to see a new light in Denver, and she got it. Yeah, it took nearly two years there, Brian, to get a new light right down here uh, after Yale at I-25. And it was part of a, a driving you crazy story that I did a few years back and why the city of Denver couldn't put a traffic light at Yale and Yale Circle right here next to the Yale Light Rail Station. Well, as part of my answer, I told Kay, uh, Carlin that the city would eventually put in a light. She just had to be patient for it. Well, the city finally completed the project almost two years after featuring this question on my Driving You Crazy segment. The new traffic light is up, it's on, and not only would the light help buses get into and out of the light rail station, but the city added a new pedestrian refuge median area to help those uh, want to walk across the roadway and facilitate a safer crossing for those who want to get over to the Yale station. Now, the money for this project came from the Elevate Denver bond program that voters approved back in 2017. That bond money will pay for critical, critical infrastructure uh, improvements just like this one over there at Yale and Yale Circle just off of I-25. All right. Thank you, Jason.